Hey guys, it's CarGuy11. I have an upcoming track day and the track recommends you have a tow hook installed on your car. Now unfortunately, the C7 Corvette doesn't come with one, oddly enough, and um, the Camaros do though, and other vehicles do, so I'm not sure why they don't include that. Now, last year when I was on the drag strip and my car broke down, I didn't have a tow hook for the for the tow truck driver, so we had to um, make additional um, provisions to uh, get my car pulled up on the tow truck. But anyway, uh, today I'm going to solve this problem. I have um, product from ZL1 Add-ons, um, front and rear tow hooks. Um, they're really, really cool, nice. Um, you can get black or red. I chose black for my car, so they. Uh, they supplied me with these today and um, this is the front one, it's a little longer. But we're going to do the uh, install and review for you guys today and I'll uh, see how they look. Now this is the rear one and I'm just going to unbox it here and a very nice packaging I have to say. Uh, and it's very heavy duty steel um, with the painted uh, toe, toe hook in black. And uh, this can move, um, there's a little set screw here. You can adjust that uh, to your liking, but we're gonna basically install it in the rear. And um, there's a little door right here to gain access to the tow point. Now, I have to say, I've, I've heard on the Corvette forms that the base model Stingrays do not have the actual receiver. Um, it's only the Z51, Grand Sports and Z06s that have these. So be aware, um, uh, if you have a base model, you probably won't be able to use these. Although I think Z01 add-ons does sell a receiver uh, for these as well. So definitely look on their website. I'll put on, I'll put their link below uh, to these hooks and to their website. So check them out. All right, I'm just gonna pry the uh, receiver door with this trim puller and it should just pop pop right out. All right, there we go. Oh, okay. Yep. So all I'm gonna do is slowly thread that in. And I'm gonna go all the way in as, until it stops. Now you can adjust this. There's a um, collar here to uh, adjust the angle and everything once you have it set the way you want it. And um, and there you go. Now I'm gonna have to get you guys' opinion on this. Uh, if you think I should leave these on or not, um, or just put them on for track use, but. Um, Let's, let's get them installed and I'll get some more pictures of it. Okay, so the front one's a little bit more complicated because it's actually behind this grill. So uh, we're gonna pop this section out and um, as you can see the receiver back there. Now, I don't think we're gonna find out if you can pop it back in after getting, getting that tow hook in there or it has to stay off. If it has to stay off, I'm definitely not leaving it on, so. Let's see what that, how it goes. Okay, I'm just gonna try to pop it out by pulling it. I don't wanna break it. Okay. There we go. Okay, I see. Um, there's just some clips at the top they slide in so not too bad not too much pressure um, yeah I definitely don't want to crack this as a plastic so okay so here is the receiver I'm just screwing this in and 
go all the way in. Okay, and the same on this side has that collar where you can adjust it. But for now, I'm just gonna keep it. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now is remove the tow hook and leave the back portion, the threaded portion, uh, in the in the receiver. And I'm gonna see if I can get the grate for the grill um, installed again, and just leave this portion uh, showing. So let's see here. Now the grate. Okay, it, it does look like does look like it fits. Um, it's it's a little bit tight, but it does look like I can get this back on and just leave it like that for track days. So that's pretty cool. All right, so this this part would be sticking out, and um, actually in the box it comes with uh, a foam here. So this might be um, I don't know. There's no instructions, but it might be to cover it. So um, yeah. But anyway, then you can just screw this back on. Or on or off as you need it. So. And again, I'm gonna ask your guys' opinion if I should keep this on or off. guys there you have it the finished product I got the grade installed and there's the tow hook I actually think it looks pretty cool but I definitely want to hear from you guys does it look to uh, ricer um, and I, as I said they do make these in red I, I went with the black so it's more subdued and um, I think it looks pretty cool in my opinion I think I'm gonna keep it on um, let me show you the back one and here's the back one. Uh, again, it's pretty subtle being black. But um, yeah, definitely let me know what you guys think. Uh, follow me on Instagram, I'll be posting more pictures. Hope you enjoyed the video. Definitely like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.